Well, hello, gang. Welcome once again to Stuff Things Place. I'm your good friend Bradley, and today's five, five Smithing Stone six. Five Smithing Stone six. I'm still not, I thought maybe we needed six Smithing Stone six. I can't remember, but I really want to go back to Round Table Hold to see if we can gas up, juice up the old Uchi Katana. But here we are at Fort Laed. Maybe it's Live, because we had Blythe. Maybe it's Live, Live. I don't know. It's a fort. There is a giant beastly creature, man-like creature with a huge, I think that's a hammer. I don't know what that is. I don't know. It looks like they have like a giant bowl or chalice on top of their helmet. I hope that Kevin can get that at some point. But we did a lot of exploration in the last episode. It was quite fun wandering around this quadrant of the Altus Plateau. And I really want to find out how to get to here where this map fragment is. But for now, we're at this fort. There were some, I guess the, uh, what are they called? Fire monk cultists hanging out outside. So I'm assuming they're going to be inside as well. So let's see what we've got here. <clears throat> yeah, weak foe. Somebody thinks it's a weak foe. We're going to do a little sneakage. Oh, he already knows we're here. Oh, look. <laughs> okay. He's very fiery. This is ridiculous. All right, we're going to be careful here. Okay. Get behind him, Kevin. All right. Okay, he does does a double. Does a double. Can I get behind you? Please? Apparently not. Ah! Jeez Louise. Okay, he's not that powerful. I mean, he's insane. He's a freaking volcano, man. Volcano. <laughs> he's a volcano. He has a volcano on his head. How would we defeat the volcano? Kevin, get behind him. I want to backstab him really bad. That could really happen, though. God damn nation. Okay. He won't backstab. I'm backstabable. He's gonna die though. Okay, <laughs> he's not that bad. A lot of bluster. <laughs> That's an awesome enemy. What is he? <gasps> the Prelate's Inferno Crozier. We have got to read this item description. The Prelate's Inferno Crozier requires 45 strength, my lord. Colossal hammer with the appearance of roiling flames. Weapon of the prelates who lead the fire monks. Okay, fire monk leader. Its heft represents the weight of their guardianship. The hammer's head is unusually substantial. Substantial and strong attacks will fling, flow, fl fling foes into the air. Okay, we can't actually use this, but we're going to try. Okay. <clears throat> Don't really have the strength to do that one-handed. What about two-handed? That is ridiculous. I won't be able to do its skill because I don't have the strength for it. Uh, that kind of does something. Wow, this thing is insane. All right. Uh, I, wow, that really looks cool. I doubt we'll ever have 45 strength, so I doubt we will ever actually wield this thing, but pretty cool. Let's put the Uchi back on. Hopefully we'll be able to upgrade this keen Uchi Katana at some point. But we'll get the egg beater back. Let's take a look around the courtyard here. So this is some sort of fire monk stronghold, I guess. Were they from Mount Gelmir? Did we read something about that, that they were originally from here? Or was that... What was it, like the Mountain of the Giants or something? I can't remember. It's a lot of shit to keep track of in this game. I'm not seeing anything. No chests or anything. All right, let's head in the doors. Interesting. The prelates. I like that. Adjust the microphone. Here we go. Alrighty. Interesting. Let us alert them to our presence by rolling through all their shit. So good. 
so good. What do we got? Armorer's Cookbook 7. Nice. Okay, let's get rid of that, please. Armorer's Cookbook 7. Uh, where are the books? Are there key items? Key items. <laughs> okay, Nomadic Warrior. Yeah, Armorer's. Okay. Giant's Flame Fire Pot. Interesting. Giant's Flame Fire Pot. You require fire blossoms. Okay. Blooms on the mountaintop of the giants. I haven't been on the mountaintop of the giants. Was I getting those from killing <clears throat> the uh, fire monk cultists, maybe? Throw at enemies to inflict heavy fire damage. Cool. All right. We're going to have to get into some of these pots at some point. And the perfumes as well. We got one of the perfumers cookbooks, I think. Or maybe two. Okay. Yeah. So these are Lindale troops, I guess. And they were attacked by the fire monks. And they no longer hold this fort. And it seems like maybe we... Oh. Hello? There's an open chest. They'll never find me. Are you the one talking, buddy? What the hell's going on? Precious item ahead, yeah. Yeah. So who's the one talking here? Fire Scorpion Charm. All right, we got to look at that. I don't think it was that guy, the ghost, because they don't talk until you click on them. Fire Scorpion, Fire Scorpion. There it is. Raises fire attack, but lowers damage negation. All right. Well, I guess I should read the description of that. Talisman carried by assassins who strike unseen, patterned on a scorpion freshly shed of its exoskeleton. Its claws seizing a heart that burns with fire. All right, that doesn't tell us much. What do you have to say? I'll survive. I swear it. I'll soon be back at the Volcano Manor. We've heard of the Volcano Manor before. All right. That's nice. Good for you. Oh, man. Can we not get back up here now? Uh, this could be a problem. Oh, here we go. All right. What else have we got? Who Who is talking in here? Slumbering egg. Somebody is hiding. Something's going on. Golden room. We're breaking everything, just in case. What was in this chest, man? Ah. Was that the guy talking, the ghost? Let's see if any of these messages tell us anything. <sighs> of course not. What is going on here? Really feels like there should be more to this, doesn't it? I mean, we have this whole wall. We have a courtyard inside. We have already been in. Can we get up on the battlements anywhere? Is that a thing? Let's jump back out here. So this guy's like chained to the floor. It looks like. Maybe it's hard to tell. So is this the person who was talking to us before? It seems like there should be more going on here. But I seriously cannot see anyone else. I can't see any way to get up, up, up on the battlements. And you would think there would be some messages around telling us more, you know, if there's more we could do in here. Huh. Interesting. I guess that's it. I'm going to peek around a little bit more and just see if there's anything else I can find, but 
as of now, not finding much. All right, gang, I didn't find anything else. I think the voice was just the ghost. Maybe it was just the ghost, but now here we are. Stop it. We have 11 flasks, which is nice. We have killed pretty much everyone around here, but there is the uh, like fire dragony thing hanging out by where Alexander is. Hey. There we go. And I would like to kill that. And I would like to talk to Alexander. I'm hoping that maybe if we kill the magma creature, uh, where was Alexander? Sort of in this direction, that maybe the lava will go away and we'll be able to talk to Alexander. Um, I should probably get some fire resistant stuff if I have anything. Where is this dude? We can summon if we wish. I think we will switch to... No. Oh, God damn it! I did not mean to do that. Damnation. Uh, where is... There is the Mimic to your Ashes. Okay. I don't think I have my flask. Oh, I do have my flask still. Let's do that. Let's banish... Oh, for God's sake. Buttons. Can I banish you? Does that mean I, I won't be able to summon my spirit ash again, though? Ah, ah, it's here. It's here. It's here. Okay, it's here. Uh, we'll, we'll try it. Ah, okay. Do the right thing. Do the right thing. There we go. Let's go. Okay, that's, that's hurting, hurting a lot. There's magma. Magma everywhere. Get him, Jelly. Doing a lot of damage. He's doing a great deal of damage. He is doing some damage as well. Not exactly sure what happened there, but this is the same creature we fought. Interestingly enough, um, where we first saw Alexander, it was in that cave by Kalid, I think originally. So it's a similar boss. So that's not bad. Oh, okay, wait a minute. The fire monks are fighting. Are they fighting the Lindale people? Yeah. Okay, so we're seeing the attack happen. That is fascinating. Wow. Okay, interesting, interesting. All right, they're done for. That's fine. We don't care about that. We're going to do this. Yoink. We are now going to do this. Hey! Friends for eternity. We haven't seen our good friend Kevin in a while. Kevin clone. Grab that. Do this. Okay, here it comes. It's on me. It's on me, gang. Get in there, Kevin. Other Kevin. Okay, I can't even approach it right now because it's in the frickin' lava. Up, other Kevin. Don't just wade through the lava, please, sir. Other Kevin. Get him, other Kevin. Okay, now we're in the lava. Son of a bastard. How are we going to get this guy out of here? We, Kevin, other Kevin, come over here. He's just luring him back into the lava, basically. Other Kevin, I'm very disappointed in you right now. We're doing some damage on this asshole, though. Here, kick. Oh, he's using he's using the alt. He's using the alt attack. Yo. Yo. I don't know if the tor if torrent is good or bad in this fight, but oh, moot point now. Get up, Kevin. Watch out, other Kevin. Oh, he's gonna get his ass kicked. Kevin! Schniz. I can't even see what the frick's happening right now. God damn it. I kinda need to be on him. I need to be locked on him so I know what the frick is going on and I can 
resist his attacks. Yes. But I also can't hit him very well. He's trying to attack Kevin, but this keeps smacking me. Can I target another part of his body so it's not just his freaking face I'm at all the time? Hit him! Oh, god damn it. Tore it! Oh, he's going down. Fucking, 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 fucking. Other Kevin! Get him, Kevin! He's on me! He's on me! He's dead. He's dead. Get him, Kevin. He's dead. Mm. Yes. Fresh for eternity, loyalty, and peace. We have the fruit we can feel. Friends forever, we'll stick together. Get on top, so we play to win. Okay. Dragonheart, new draconic power. Awesome. Alexander? It's it's rather hot out there, is it not? Oh, mountain of fire. Bake me in your flames. Oh, is he firing himself? Because he's a pot. How do I get over and talk to him? Summon steed. What? But I'm not fighting anymore. Okay. I thought I could summon him if I wasn't actually fighting. We need to talk to Alexander. How are we getting in here? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, Torrent. Sorry, Torrent. Uh, Alexander, I would like to go see you now. How are we going to do this? Offer rump. I don't see Alexander anymore, by the way. Oh, there he is. How are we going to get up to him? It looks like some of these fire monks have just kind of flung themselves into the fire to get close to it. I'm wondering if we try to jump with Torrent, like do a little double jump, if we can get far enough. I don't think so. How the hell are we going to do this? How are we going to get to him? Oh, for rump. Oh, sorry, Torrent. Sorry, Torrent. That sucks. That sucks for you, my friend. We could feed Torrent some of these thingies that we have. Where are those? Nope. Uh, didn't we make some of those? Row of whatever berries? I guess we could craft them. I don't know what anything is. Where are they? They're consumables. Where are they? Boluses. Row of raisins. Don't I have some? Yeah, it says I have 24 of them. Where the hell are they? Oh, there we go. Okay. Healed him a little bit. Here we go. Torrent is amazing. Okay, how do we actually get near him to talk, though? This is a problem. Alexander. Okay, get off the horse. Get off the horse. Oh, mountain of fire. Bake me in your flames. Mm. Hello. Ah, good sir. What business might you have in such a place as this? I could I ask you the same question, my friend. Yourself in play, considering that fleshly form of yours. Your timing though is impeccable as ever i've been making just the thing for you on my journey here take it i'm sure it'll suit you to tea. Ooh, what is it alex <gasps> jar okay this is in oh is that a jar helmet but, uh, it's hardly more than lukewarm here i won't be able to temper my body such that it'll never crack again perhaps i'll head eastward there's an old saying i've caught wind of Above the lofty clouds, the 
Icy Giant's peak doth soar. Mountain of the Giants. Here lieth the flame of ruin, which ever burning roars. He's kind of like a combo between Solaire and Siegward or Siegmire, where he's sort of hapless. I have to keep rescuing him, but then he's also searching like Solaire was searching for his son. Now he is searching for the flame that can be strong enough to temper him, to fire him properly so he won't crack. All right, let's see what he gave us here. I think it's a freaking helmet. I think it's a jar helmet. Oh my God. Jar that fits cleanly over the head when upturned, made with pride by Iron Fist Alexander. It's unique in a uniquely jar-like gesture of friendship. It boosts the power of throwing pot items. Oh, okay, that's interesting. It's nice, it's heavy, and I'm sure Kevin will look like a maniac. <laughs> Yay, pothead! Kevin is a pothead! Hooray! Oh, shit, Kevin. Don't fall down. Hey! Mm, 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 mm. Let's do a gesture of thanks to our good friend, Alexander. <laughs> now that is a thumbnail. Beautiful. All right, we got to get out of here. Hopefully Torrent will lead us to safety here. Come on, Torrent. We'll use the pothead for a little bit. Sorry, Torrent. Oh, those little hoofies getting kind of burned. All right, so everyone's back alive around here. We still have yet to find where we can actually, where we can actually get the map fragment. I'm not sure. Craftsman Shack, there was other stuff around here. Magma Worm Maker, Abandoned Coffins. That's where we came originally. Craftsman Shack. Yeah, I don't know where we should go. <sighs> I want to probe around this area a little bit more. Maybe if we try to find this, this will take us where we need to go. So let's strike out to the northeast. I don't know that we can actually do that, though. No. <laughs> we need to somehow get up there. So let's let's circle around again, see what happens. Hello. We've already killed you once, right? We're not doing it again. God, even the room bear is back alive here. This is a hostile territory here. Oh, a little mini room bear. Forgot about that. Is there any way to get back up onto that giant plateau? God, it sure doesn't look like it. And get to where it seems like the map fragment is, because I would love it. Now, what did we find here before? There's something going on over here. Yeah, there's more of these assholes. Okay, here's the side of grace we found. We've got the little, like, ninja demi-humans. Cool. What else was here? Oh yeah, that. Jesus Christ, it's all back here. God damn it. I thought maybe that thing would stay dead. Oh, it's coming. Oh, it's it's a no. Holy mother of God. Okay. Hey, I'm gonna die. Hurry up, Kevin. This thing is very dangerous. Yikes. I'm gonna have to kill this thing. Yeah, bloodlust. Lots of bloodlust. Let's let's go in here. Hermit village. Uh, people everywhere. Oh Lord. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to kill a bunch of these assholes. Oh Lord. Ah, uh, jump, Kevin. <laughs> Was not expecting this. Son of a. Where is this guy? This is the one I want. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is a lot of dudes. A lot of dudes at once. Ow! That helps. Get away from me. Away from me! Away from me! I 
can't do this right now. Son of a bastard. Oh my lord. I just realized I have 98,000 runes as well. <laughs> we have to rescue these runes and we have to get the frick out of here. We will have to wipe out all of these crazy demon humans. We'll have to wipe, wipe out the, uh, whatchamacallums? The Beastmen of Ferm Azul, or whatever the hell they're called. Holy mother of God. Okay. Let's try to do this. Hermit Village. Run. Run. Got him. Oh, Jesus. Look at it, it's a demi-human queen. There's all sorts of nonsense going on around here. Ah, okay. Too many people at once, too many people at once. Come on, Kevin. Here we go. Jeez, that was, that was annoying. Nice, Kevin. Nice, Kevin clone. Oh, baby. That was a beauty. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. We're on a roll here, gang. Oh, you already got him. Come here. Come here. You little son of a bitch. What the? Okay, got him, got him, got him. Let's go, Kevin. Let's go. We're rolling. We're rolling, buddy. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Okay. Demi human queen Maggie. Missed. She's got, she's got mages. Hey, that hurts her. Let's go. I can't freaking hit her. Let's get this asshole. Stop it. Okay, you will die. Get her, Kevin. I keep missing with that. How am I not hitting her? Maybe I am. Come on, Maggie. Dirty Maggie Mae, they are taking her away. Let's go. Jump, Kevin. Get in there, you son of a bitch. Mm, that did it. That did it. Oh, that did it. Holy crap. Get her, Kevin. Get him. Finish her off. Finish her off. Beautiful. Two bosses in one episode. A magma worm and a demi-human queen, Maggie. Okay, looks like there's a side of grace over here as well. That's fantastic, but all the beast men, all the demi-humans are, are going to be back if I rest at it. What the fuck is that? That seems dangerous. But not, I guess. What the hell? Hold on. I have no idea. But we will speak to this thing in the next episode of Stuff and Things Plays. Until next time, tell me to get I'm doing late. I'll see you later. Man, things just keep getting more and more insane and more and more cool. Kevin, stand next to this thing. What is it? What is it? <laughs>